guys. Um, it's me, Mission Gingy. What's up? I'm um, the Skyrim LP is coming. However, there have been a few recording issues. I've had to get the webcam replaced. I've had to mess about with the um, video settings. I've had to uninstall Skyrim as well to make room for a couple of other games that I was playing in the mid time as well. But the uh, I'm reinstalling it tomorrow and the Skyrim LP is coming, so hold your horses, it'll come, just be patient, peace. In the meantime, however, I'm bringing you gameplay of a very good game, um, Democracy 3, which is an excellent game, made by Polytech and a couple of other people who were collaborating, and it's essentially, if you don't know, it's a political simulator, it's very, 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 very in-depth, and it has some excellent DLCs on here that I don't have, I want them though. Anyways, I'm not going to waste my time talking about it. Let's show you a uh, new game. Go Canada. Increase <coughs> political update. Decrease difficulty just a bit. With the decreased difficulty, I will decrease the time limits and time length. Those those things look good enough. Okay. The gingies. No, wrong way. The gingies. It will be I for E. The gingies. This is. Well, I think we can all figure it out. It's not hard. <clears throat> the dickheads. That could be attributed to several different political parties. I'm um, not naming any names. Don't worry. <clears throat> um, jokes. And so it'll be the gingers versus the dickheads. Let's go. Gary Manning can constant. What? <laughs> Consistent. Fuck that. I'm not. Even, I'm not even gonna try and pronounce that. Patronizing the electorate. Posturing on foreign policy. Preparing sound. Pod policy. Policy. Sorry. Can't talk today. Preparing sound bites. Inventing the internet. Compiling misleading statistics. All the stuff that governments like to do. If you can't tell, I've not recorded in a while, in case you've not been paying attention, so I'm a bit out of whack. Apparently crime is a huge po uh, problem in uh, Canada. What? Canada's peaceful as fuck? Why is crime a problem? Uh, education, that's doing well, but how? Well, health's not doing great, actually. Health is sort of low, but it's not bad. It's not in the red yet. <coughs> Farms like me, state employees like me, retired love me, and socialists are um, are in the yeah, that's okay. They're religious, all of a sudden. Okay, so we've got problems with homelessness, unprotected economy, pollution, asthma epidemic. Holy shit! There's quite a few problems. Vigilante mobs and organized crime. Because this is a realistic representation of Canada, everybody. I won't question this game's unquestionable logic. Alright then. Uh, vigilante mobs. Hmm. I'll increase CCTV cameras from widespread simply to um, decrease vigilante mobs. Help with that problem. 
I'll skip a couple of quarters simply to get more uh, political capital. That's basically what you use to um, make decisions and stuff, like managing taxes up and down and stuff. I'll show you a couple of things. This is the intelligence briefing. This is like the war room to see who hates you. <clears throat> you got the Church of Christ, Human Rights Society, the Communist Party, Judicial Values Alliance, all that stuff. Th and all those people <clears throat> control these. Th those people cannot like you, and that can have negative effects on your country and your government and stuff. But these people are the extremist groups, and they're the people who will do horrible things to you, like assassinate your sorry ass. So, be careful. Can't count the, the amount of times I've actually been assassinated. It's pretty much exclusively by capitalists and religious people. But for that one time where I was killed by a liberal sniper. Why? <laughs> Again, this game has unquestionable logic. Actually, I was being a bit tight fisted and stuff. I was. I wasn't exactly a great president of America. I don't know, but liberals weren't too pleased with me. Anyway. Uh, yeah. I'm not going to try and re rekindle the relationship with the religious people. I think it's gone a bit beyond that. They hate me at this point already. Um, already then. Make state housing a bit higher. No, we won't cancel it. Right, we're not losing money yet. Well, we're obviously spending it, but we're not losing money. We need to increase the out uh, outcome income. Sorry. Um. Again, can't update school prayers. Yeah, on parents' request. Actually, no, I'll make it optional. Only so uh, it'll make it less likely for uh, like racial tension to happen, like the Black Power Group to kill me. Or something. That that does happen. Limit agency activity. I don't want to let tax agents brutalize my public hell no um what should I do after my banana finish out the environment environment clean energy subsidies Now I'm going to increase a tax. I think I'll do tobacco tax. Give myself a higher income. I can't raise that. I'm going to have to go to the next quarter. <laughs> Buying votes. I are criminal. I am scandalous. This is pure fiction. When you spent half your life dealing with political conundrums and I'm set every other question I ask. Fuck off, my God. Um, I'm joking. I'm, I'm not actually being disrespectful to a dead woman. I'm just, you know. Reject that proposal. I'm not going all big brother on the country. Hell no. Uh, this game starts off slow, but trust me, it'll get a lot more interesting. Oh, shit, it's done. Okay, guys, I uh, hope you've enjoyed this video. I'll come at you with another one pretty soon. Uh, the time is running low on the recording, because again, I still have the recording recording, because I haven't bought body cam yet. It's kind of expensive, so... Mm. Um, see you guys. Mission Gingy. Turn to my channel sometime.